What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Um, I kind of ended the video short yesterday, so it's going to be a continuum. We're basically going to put another coat of stain on the pieces here. And then I picked up some of this waterproof spray. I'll show it to you real quick. I've never used it before. I've never even heard of it, but I was like, why not? Um, Weather Guard wood sealer uh, repels water and stuff. And basically, so when, so you can tell there's an O-ring there from a drink. But I'm going to spray this on there and on the top. So if I do have a drink and on like the cup holders and stuff, it will repel it. These pieces over here are painted black. I'm going to hit those again. But I just want to kind of continue so you guys could stay like up to date on the video and stuff. We've been working on farm equipment, getting ready for hay season. So I might do some videos on that, but I don't know if you guys would be interested in stuff like that. But that'd just be a fun project. We have a Alice Chalmers D19. We'd probably change the oil and like do a tune-up kit and stuff on it but let me know what you guys think so i'm gonna stop talking and we're gonna jump right back into this so uh stay tuned guys So on the second coat guys, I basically just brushed it on there as you've seen from that fast forwarding clip. Then I came back with a shop towel and wiped it all off so it, it's not as dark. Um, that piece is a little bit darker but this piece is going to be underneath everything so I'm not too concerned about it. And then the cup holders are going to be match that pretty well. But I'm going to let it dry now and then I don't know how long this has to dry before I can spray that waterproofing stuff on it. But I'll probably let it dry for a couple hours and then I'm going to throw on another coat of paint on the black decorative balls over there. So once all this gets dry, I'll bring you guys back for assembly and then we should be good to go. guys you noticed I have changed clothes um, that is because the other day when I was gonna go assemble all this and I put the waterproofing spray on it it didn't dry all the way and there was fingerprints in it so I kind of had to redo it so I had to kind of sand a little bit and then respray it but now we should be good to go um, that's what it looks like we're gonna go ahead and do assembly real quick get it all tossed back on there so you guys can see what it looks like the project overall hasn't been difficult. Um, it's been a little bit time consuming just because you have to wait for like your stain and stuff to dry, but it's like nothing too terribly hard. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and jump right into it. Not sure why the camera's out of focus, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and jump right into it and uh, you'll see it when it gets. 
So I didn't get any footage of me actually putting it together um, just because it took a little bit longer than I was expecting. Um, it looks extremely good though. I am really pleased on how it turned out. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys. I'll throw some before and after pictures of it in the um, end of the video. But it wasn't super hard to put back together. Um, I'm still, it's still a little tacky, but like I said, I put that uh, liner down in the bottom. I didn't, I didn't stain the bottom because it's probably gonna stay closed half the time. But yeah, it all um, functional still. So pretty simple project just to make the seat look a lot better. Um, like I said, I'll toss some before and afters in the end of the video so you can actually see what it looked like and compare the two. Um, the top of the lid got a little bit darker than I was expecting it to actually get. Um, if it would have looked like this piece here, that'd have been awesome. But just these grains that are so close together, um, it just kind of absorbed, absorbed it a lot more than I thought it would. But it still looks really good. Um, remember, guys, we are running a giveaway on a 32-inch light bar and four LED pods till uh, February 28th at midnight. We are currently running... A discount code on the GM Man Shopify. All that's down in down in the description. Just go click. Every ten dollars you spend on merchandise, you get one entry. You spend twenty, you get two, thirty, you get three. But right now, if you enter the code the GM Man, it'll be right here. You get free shipping on everything. So uh, go spend some money, um, get an entry before the giveaway is over. There is not very many people, um, which is. I mean, it's kind of sad, but I guess no one wants to win a 32-inch light bar and four pods for 10 bucks. I mean, it's over $100 in value. But anyway, remember, uh, learning as I do, doing what I love. I'm the GM man. Thanks for watching, guys. If you're new, smash the subscribe button. Remember, enter the giveaway. Ends February 28th, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Ryan Little.